Hey guys, what's up? Uh, Passive Baller here. We are now on this uh, December 28, 2021 NBA game day. Uh, to begin this, uh, we will be talking about this game between Milwaukee Bucks with a record of 22-13 and, and the home team Orlando Magic um, with a banged up record of 7-27. and Alright, this one will be played at 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, so that's 8 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. And before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller, please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, um, notifications will be sent to you whenever new videos are uploaded, just like this one. Alright, let's take a look at the Eastern Conference standings first. Um... Milwaukee Bucks, they are at number 3. They're sitting at number 3 position. And uh, for their last 10 games, uh, they've won 6. And approaching this game, they are on a 3-game winning streak. For Orlando Magic, sadly, they are at number 14 of the Eastern Conference. For their last 10 games, only 2, win only two wins uh, for Orlando Magic. And approaching this game, they're even on a back-to-back -back losing streak. Alright, Orlando Magic will be enjoying the home court advantage. Um, momentum, though, is obviously with uh, Milwaukee, um, as Milwaukee is in a three-game uh, winning streak. Um, approaching this game, both teams are actually on, uh, Chamaholdis are actually coming from rest, so um, there shouldn't be any talk about fatigue. Um, but Orlando Magic is still banged up. Like, and when they say banged up, they really are pretty banged up. Um, I still see a lot of players in the injury list right now. Um, as we speak, I have Cole Anthony, OKK, Johnson, Mulder, MCW, Mo Bamba, Terrence Ross, Etwan Moore, Fultz, Suggs, their rookie, and Isaac. So that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. 11 players uh, confirmed out for Orlando Magic. And that, man, again, that includes Anthony and Bamba. Those are, you know, their main, you know, their main players down there. Um, so uh, I can just uh, think of um, Carter uh, as the, one of their main guys still playing for uh, Orlando Magic. Um, they also have, what's the name of that dude? Uh, the, the other guard, shoot the shooting guard. Um, I mean, the... Forgot the name though, Davis. Um, yeah, I guess it's Davis. No, I'm sorry. I'm thinking about I'm thinking about the different person. It's Gary Harris. Gary Harris is available. Of course, Robin Lopez is available too. So um, we'll see what they can do. You know, against this man, uh, defending champions Milwaukee Bucks. Now, um, the thing about Milwaukee Bucks is that uh, the reasons to why they're uh, a bit scary year now is that they're getting healthier um right now if i would uh, if i would check on um the injury list only one name is actually listed on the injury list and that is brooke lopez and the rest are available for the defending champs so i guess this one's pretty academic um milwaukee bucks will actually take home this w um i'm looking at the spread as we speak it's minus 12.5 for milwaukee bucks uh for some that may be too big um and that's, yeah, uh, that, uh, they got a point. Because uh, uh, the thing about this Orlando Magic squad is that even though they have been losing, and they have been, really, um, they are fighting, you know. Um, some of these players that they have are coming from the uh, G League. Uh, some of those players are just um, re-signed players. And, you know, you know they're, they're out there trying to prove um, their worth, you know, trying to make a name out of, them, out of themselves. That's why they're really pushing hard. Um, but 12.5, I know that's big, but we're talking about Milwaukee Bucks down here, the defending champions going up against Orlando Magic, a, a, you know, a team which is underperforming at the same time, banged up. So 12.5, I guess I, I can't go again. I, I can't go against the defending champions with that. So I'm going to pick Milwaukee Bucks minus 12.5 on this. And I'm pretty confident that, uh, Yanis along with his friends would actually cover this one. Bucks, minus 12.5. Peace out, pase love, and God bless.